Welcome back. If you have not tried a cream puff this year, well, this is the year to do it. This morning we are talking all things Wisconsin State Fair, one of my favorite times of year. I'm here with Christy. We've been having a lot of fun this morning talking about the cream puffs because this year you guys are celebrating 100 years. Yes, 100 years of cream puffs. That is so cool. Mm -hmm. And they are known for these cream puffs. I mean, you guys make them there at the fairgrounds, which I just found out from you a few minutes yes, ago. Yes, they are fresh every day. They keep rolling them out. You can get them at the Cream Puff Pavilion. So when you're waiting in line, you can actually watch them being made, which is a lot of fun. But we also have other locations throughout the fair park. If you don't want to wait in the line, you can get them at our express locations and it's a lot quicker. Well, the one thing I like about them is they're not heavy as they look. They're very light and airy and delicious. We'll get to the Cream Puffs in just a bit, but let's talk about um, just the State Fair in general. What mm -hmm. can people expect? Let's start with the food aside from the Cream Puffs. Yep. So the fair's August 1st through the 11th. We have 100 new foods and beverages beyond the new cream puff flavors that we talked a little bit about. Um, all of those foods are online, wistatefair.com. We have 10 new vendors this year. We have over 650 vendor locations at the fair, so there is food literally everywhere you turn. This blows my mind. How do you come <laughs> up with 100 new foods in one year? Um, and this year you guys have all sorts of new stuff, especially with the theme of cream puffs. You have cream puff soda, but yes. you also told me this morning that it's the year of the pickle, right? Yes, there are just those new foods. We have the entire list online at wistatefair.com, but it's almost like every four to new items is something related to pickles, including drinks like purple pickle lemonade. Wow. So I would definitely, again, go online and check that out. If you like pickles, this might be your year. Perfect. Mm -hmm. And then let's talk about the entertainment yeah. um, briefly. What can people expect on the main stage? So we always have a very diverse lineup. TLC is coming this year. Um, Foreigner, their farewell tour if you're into classic rock. Um, we always have comedians. Charlie Behrens is coming. That's a really Wisconsin thing, but he's coming back this year. So those are main stage concerts. Those tickets include your fair admission, but we have 30 other stages at the fair as well. So those are all included in your $18 you ticket. Have food, live entertainment, all sorts of great stuff. Now we want to show this cream puff right here because I'm actually going to try this, but you're telling me about a debate of the cream puff. Mm -hmm. What is it? Because I remember trying these last year and they do get kind of messy. They are messy. So the debate is, I call it hamburger style, but where you just pick it up and dive right in. The problem with that is the cream tends to squish out the sides. Okay, so last so, year I was the messy so one. So twist. Oh, twist. Twist, yes, like an Oreo. They'll pull that off. See, and then it's a lot easier to eat it that way. Okay, perfect. Mm -hmm. Let me take a bite. These look absolutely delicious. So... You have to tell me, do you think this is the right method or do you feel like you should just go in? For the sake of live television, <laughs> this is great because look, I'm already messy. But if I was outside in the sun, I'll eat it. Just all go of, for it. All of it. Just enjoy it. It's absolutely delicious. Well, thank you so much for joining us, yes. Christy. We want to pull up some details for you on your screen real quick. Again, this is August 1st through 11th. There's more information on wistatefair.com. We didn't talk about the rides or the livestock, but all sorts of great stuff. Mm -hmm. And again, go out and celebrate 100 years of the cream puff.